Hello everybody, here we are once again at Southern City College, Birmingham with myself, John Collins. Short demonstration on the QTEC KT63 doing continuity testing in constant testing mode using my Socket R2 adapter in conjunction with my little jump linking leads. Okay, so here we go. We've inspected the instrument itself and we put it onto our FC2000 checkbox to make sure everything's all okay. So the first thing we need to do is simply join up together and plug in the port. So we're doing R1, so the brand into the brand, and the R2 into the R2 port there. However, we need to null the leads. So it's dead simple. I'll turn my tester onto continuity. If you look at the scale there, dark blue is continuity, auto ranging. And all I simply do with my jump lead is make a circuit between my R1 and my R2 like so. Press the null. There you have it, 0 0.14 is the resistance of the leads and my jump lead. Press the test button, it'll go to zero. I'm now going to press the hands free so it's in constant testing mode. Now one of the useful features of the uh, KT63 is that on the back there it's got magnet so that when you mount on site, if you've got any metal enclosures, you can simply just put it onto the lid like so. Make sure you've got good batteries. And we have it like holding on there, no problem at all. I'll just plug it into this socket here. Not doing the test yet because I haven't pressed the test button. With my jump lead, here's the concern unit. It's already safely isolated. I'll put my linking lead onto the buzz bar like so there for the R1 and onto the DBMET for the R2. If I now press the test button, it's in constant testing mode, you will not see a circuit because all the circuit breakers are switched off. I'll simply turn them on and off one at a time. As it's in constant testing mode, waiting for it to make a circuit. And there you have it, the socket is on circuit number one, giving me an R1 plus R2 of 0 0.13. However, I must check the operation of the switch, the functional switch, and turn it back on. <coughs> and there you have it. It's as simple as that using the QTEC R2 socket. This, by the way, is for the radial circuit and not a ring final. And there you have it, folks. Remember, Johnny Ace is on the case.